hello guys welcome back so we are going to start by creating something to the from scratch first you open the application you choose a desired dimension and then you hit create tap on the plus and select an image to add you use opacity after adding the peak I'll start tracing on it Okay, 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 I got you, I got you guys. We are going to start from the very basic. First, let's head over to Play Store and do some search. Input Medibank Paint in the search bar and search. If you are really excited and you, you want to see more of this, you know what to do. Just hit that like button. I'm able to share this maybe with a friend who is interested to learn. As you can see, Medibank Paint has 4.1 star rating on the Play Store. I think that's fair enough. You can see on the ratings, ratings that people have been giving the app. It's a very good app. So I already have the app installed, so I'm not going to download it again. All you have to do is like any other normal app just hit the install button after downloading we install and you launch it it's free in the play store after launching the app first you need to create a free account after you tap after creating the free account you can tap on edit in this edit area now we are going to put in your desired dimension I always like to go with 720 720 because with this dimension you can be on you can be put on any social media platform such as instagram or any other place So when you first open the app, you will be presented with this interface. There are many brushes, many brushes. The pencil brush is my favorite brush that I always use. The left arrow at the bottom left is to undo and the other is to redo. Now let's talk about layers. Let's say I add a layer, a color layer, a color on a layer. Then I create another layer and put it under the first layer. Anything I do on the layer below another layer remains under the layer. I hope it makes sense. Now to add an image, select an image to add. That's good, you guys have it right now. When you add an image, you have the option to change its magnification in the bottom left. You can see magnification that is to make it to change the size. Now, here, yeah, extra line act would ask you this question extra line act yes or no? I always use tap on no, but if you tap on yes going to be converted into like this black and white effect school black and white effect so I'm not interested in that so I don't always use it now after adding your picture you on the picture layer you reduce opacity 
after reading the opacity make sure you always lock the layer to avoid working on it now you create another layer above the image layer like i have said before anything that goes under a layer is below the layer now if you create an image above the layer anything you do would be above the layer you select your desired brush always like to use the pencil brush because it has that fine ended so after selecting your desired brush you zoom in and you start tracing and you start tracing on the, on the image I'm using my finger actually to trace now let's talk about exporting because you know after doing all your your masterpiece you have to export it because if you don't export it then you have not done any work now when you to export you tap on the three straight lines at the bottom left and select export now when you click on export you'll be presented with png png transparent background and the jpeg PNG transparent background is it has no background. Mm. And the JPEG is the solid format which has a background. So I usually, I usually go with the JPEG. You make your choice. And then finally you now have your masterpiece. Help me in sharing the video because when you share the video, it's going to keep the journey alive thanks very much okay guys let me know what you think in the comment section about this first video you know the audio everything let me know what you think so this is the next picture we are going to be transforming we are going to convert it from the real image into a cartoon from start to finish everything you need to know I'm going to do it in a series form it's going to be step by step slow and understandable thanks